The stormy weather did not stop Tom's River residents from supporting their first responders this morning. A line of 30 cars traveled from the Elks Lodge to the Community Medical Center Hospital to cheer on the nurses and doctors who are working tirelessly during this COVID-19 pandemic. Pride, absolute pride and joy. It was, it was just a wonderful feeling. We were glad to give to them and they were glad to give back to us. And they were putting life online every day. All for us. People take it for granted. It's just our way of saying, hey, thank you so much. It was an overwhelming procession of thanks. Of course, from more than six feet away, signs were held up in the cars cheering on our first responders. I'm just glad we got all these members to show up for the, uh, the showing at the hospital, supporting our, our hospital nurses, doctors, emergency people. Everybody, it was, it's a good turnout. We checked in with the Toms River Fire Department on how their daily routines have changed since the pandemic hit. Toms River has the second highest number of confirmed cases in Ocean County. Having to um, handle every call differently with deconning trucks, deconning personnel, you know, trying to keep a distance. We're not used to that. We're usually right up in everybody's front door. And now we have to stay back and assess every situation see if it's safe to go in just you know just we got to stay safe is the biggest thing just keeping everybody together like this is great you know that's the biggest thing we just got to keep our distance and everybody has to be aware of how serious this thing really is and just keep your distance and you know god bless everybody stay well i think so i think they got our message loud and clear and we did bring a whole bunch of food too reporting in tom's river for new jersey news network i'm kimberly jade